Hello folks, today we're doing a building inspection on a commercial building and what I wanted to share with you is this fake rock. It's a plastic and a coating, it's got styrofoam, but what's happened is, is now, you know, it's just literally getting water in behind it, it's getting in behind this. You can see where I'm starting to get some crackage coming down here from the water freezing and thawing in here. And it's just a mess everywhere. But what the biggest problem I worry about is not so much that, is that, but it's also, because this is all needs to be removed and uh, tore off and removed. And that's a quick, easy thing. But because of that styrofoam or that uh, insulation behind this, literally, it's like a sponge and it causes a type of corrosion to the metal so i'm anxious to get on the inside of it and just see what kind of mess that i'm really getting into but look at this i mean it just shows where the water gets down in there and this is the power of water it gets down behind there and cracks and breaks and and it's just poor installation from the very beginning no there's really no excuse for this anyway folks thank you for watching our videos i hope this has been educational but actually so you really do want to make sure that you watch for this kind of problems uh, water getting in behind your siding uh, even if it's like a you know it's just a, a, a siding on top of a siding you still want to make sure it's not getting any kind of moisture issues because it's going to create a lot of issues and a lot of problems anyway hit like and subscribe we appreciate you watching our videos share with your friends when you hit subscribe this helps us help a lot of other people learn exactly what to look for what not to look for especially in commercial buildings what a mess what a mess look at that look at that we even had to screw the damn gum thing on here <laughs> that's how bad it is anyway folks thank you for watching our videos and god bless you all appreciate you